Some people take an image galaxy of a small refractor, but I'm here to prove them wrong. Hi, I'm Tom from Avid Astronomy. Spring is galaxy season, and I want to be a part of it. The only issue? The biggest telescope I have is the Raptor 61. How can I possibly capture galaxies 12 million light years away with such a small refractor? Galaxy season is dominated by large telescopes with over 800 millimeter focal length. The Raptor 61 on the other hand, has 273 millimeter focal length. Yet, I still pulled off this image. This image is a, the accumulation of 43 3 minute, 30 second exposures. This comes out to a, a total of 2 hours 30 minutes and 30 seconds. The galaxies in this image are the Cigar Galaxy, Bode's Galaxy, and NGC 3077. These three galaxies are part of the M81 group. M81 is the designation of Bode's Galaxy, which was the first discovered object of the three. I took this image using my Rebel T6, my Raptor 61, and the SV Boney light pollution filter, all on my Star Adventure. So not only was this an image using a small refractor, but also on a small Star Tracker, and not a big computerized mount. I'm not saying it's easy. I started this project at 9 at night and finished at 3.30 in the morning. It took me an hour to find the objects originally. Then at 10.30, I had to do a meridian flip where I adjusted the angle of the tracker so that my camera wouldn't hit the tripod and I had to refine the objects all over again. Then every two hours, I had to check on the setup just to make sure everything was running fine and no batteries were dying. But after all of this, I got this image and I proved it was possible to capture galaxies with a small refractor. Well, let me know in the comments below if you've taken images of galaxies and what telescope you used. I hope you enjoyed the video and remember keep staring at the stars.